Hi, I'm Brad. I'm a uh, Polyglot developer. I write multiple programming languages, and here's how I manage that configuration for me in Vim. Uh, so I use a distro called LazyVim. Um, it's sort of a distro, sort of a starter kit. I guess a starter kit is probably a more appropriate term, but also that's kind of what a distro is. So here we are. Uh, and the key thing that I really want to talk about today is Mason. So if I hit colon, type Mason with a capital M, this pulls up my, uh, well, it pulls up Mason. So what is Mason? Uh, Mason's by William Bowman. So if we click this, pull this up right here, uh, we can see it's a portable package manager for NeoVim that runs everywhere that NeoVim runs. Uh, easily install and manage LSP servers, ka-ching, uh, DAP servers, linters, and formatters. Um, so you can find information about it here, how to use it. Uh, the short and sweet is that it's fantastic. Uh, it is my favorite tool that I've used for this. Uh, so we have a couple different options here. Um, the short and sweet is I have these packages installed. Uh, if you want to install a new package, you can find them. So let's say I want an LSP. So I'm going to hit two because it says uh, two up here for LSP. We turn on LSP. Uh, let's find we've got we've got uh, Dino, Go, please, Lua language server, Svelte language server, and ZLS, which is the Zig language server. Um, let's think of another language server that we might want to install. Uh, so uh, we can hit Control F to filter. .NET. Let's take a look at .NET. No LSPs for .NET, really. There's .NET Core debug, but no LSPs. Maybe .NET's a bad choice. Let's see what else we've got. We have um, Oh, how about NIM? So you can see here there's NIM LSP. So if I want to install this, all I have to do is hit the uh, U key. So if I hit, U, or sorry, the I key for install, U is for update. Uh, you can see it looks like it's actually having an issue installing that. Uh, so maybe that LSP is not going to work. Uh, so let's see if we hit G question mark, we can see here. Uh, more information about these packages. To uninstall a package, it's capital X. So we're back into our, our main screen for Mason. Uh, all I want to do is find something to install. Uh, so uh, Angular's got an LSP, right? So we can grab the Angular LSP, hit I to install. Uh, you can see that it's installing here, so it'll install for me. And then the next time I pull up an Angular application, it will use the Angular language server in my Vim uh, or my NeoVim configuration. Um, to give me language server style completion and really any other tools that are provided by that language server. I don't write Angular, so I'm going to go ahead and uninstall this with uh, capital X. Um, and yeah, I think that should be uh, a pretty good tutorial. So um, you can install LSPs, DAPs, linters, and formatters as mentioned above. I highly recommend it. Uh, if you're using NeoVim, this is a fantastic tool for working with uh, managing those packages. So check it out and uh, have a great day.